So for those of you using Magento 2, uh, you may have observed that um, grouped pricing has kind of disappeared as one of the options. So group pricing being the way that we can, we can change the price of an individual product depending on which customer group is looking at that product. Okay, so it has disappeared, but there is a fairly simple fix to the problem. And actually what, what has happened, it's been amalgamated in with the tiered pricing. So let me just show you what I've done here um, very quickly. I have understores in customer groups. I have created a customer group, which is called VIP. Okay, so I just added a new customer group, created a customer group called VIP. So I also had, let me have a look at our customers. I'd also created a customer and account for myself. And what I then did was I assigned that customer account to the VIP customer group. So you can see that there. So that's fairly straightforward stuff. So let's have a look at a product then. So if I go to the product catalog and within here, I have a product that I've already set up to have a grouped price. So that's this plain green t-shirt here. Now, what I want to show you is I'm going to go in to edit the product. While I'm doing that, I'm just going to show you on the front end here. So currently, this account here is not signed in. Okay, so this is the not logged in customer group that this is looking at. And you can see here that the product is marked as $40. Just click into the product just to be doubly sure. And you can see there that we have a product of $40. Okay, let's go and have a look at the setup in here. So what I've done is under the advanced settings, we have an advanced pricing option. So you can see within here, we've got the special price and the from and to date. And we would expect somewhere in around here, we'd expect to have a group price. And the group price would look similar to the tiered price where we select what website, what group that price is for, and then put a price in. What we've done instead is we've just used the tiered price. And this time around, we said it's for all websites. And from here, we can select what customer group we want this tiered price to be applicable for. So I only want it to be applicable for the VIP. And I'm saying here, if they're in the VIP customer group, they will get that price for $20. Uh, $20. I can go on and create more. I can have as many of these as I want. Okay, very similar to how uh, it worked on Magento 1. Right, so I save that. Now, what I'll find on the front end now is if I sign into that account that I just set up, the VIP, the account that's assigned to VIP, and I'll just put in my uh, account details here, and I'll log into this account. Okay, I'm logged into the account as the VIP customer. So now if I go back to the category page, what you should see is we now have the t-shirt marked at $20 was $40. I just click through onto that. And we can now see it's marked as $20. So if you want to use group pricing, basically just use the tiered pricing option and just assign a quantity of one to the group and that'll be your group price. Simple as that.